Hey guys, this is Snack Attack 8, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 7 Blind. This is part 9. Uh, in the last episode, if you remember, we came here because we saw that Tifa had gotten kidnapped, and we found that she's at this place um, by this guy. She's being held by this guy named Don Corneo, and I believe in this episode we're gonna try to find a way that we can get Cloud into his, like, palace. And Eris seems to think that the best way to do that is by getting Cloud to dress up like a girl. <laughs> so, maybe we'll do that. Um, now, I watched over the last footage, and I don't... There, I didn't really see any indication of how to get Cloud dressed up like a girl. So, I remember there was a shop that had, like, clothes in it. So, I think we're gonna try to go there, because that seems like it'd be the right place, right? I don't remember which shop that was. It wasn't this one. But there was one like that, yeah? I think I remember that. Because I think I even remarked, I was like, oh, can we, like, buy clothes here or something? It wasn't the item shop. This is the shop with the machine gun uh, that'll shoot you for buying anything. It's not a very good way to uh, get business. This is the inn with the toilet. Uh, and this is nothing. Maybe it was... Am I thinking... I hope I'm thinking of the right place. That might have been in the other slums. Now I can't remember. Uh, but we'll go in all the shops to make sure. Maybe it was this. Uh, oh, do, do you have anything to say to me yet? Got a minute? Okay, so we can talk to him now. Uh, what is it? Really appreciate it. Sorry, but young lady, would you turn the other way for a second? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Eris, just let us be alone. Jeez. Sorry, lady. Here's the thing. Do you know that vending machine in the inn? I have not seen it, but I'm sure I could find it. Mitching to know what they're selling in it. I just can't ask a girl to go get it. Uh, why don't I buy it myself? Well, I'll tell you the truth. I got in a fight with a guy in the end, and I can't go there anymore. How come? Come on, so how about it? Sure. <laughs> Finished? Yes. Uh, maybe this will help us in our quest to be a lady. I don't know. Uh, the inn... Alright, so the inn is... Is this one. Not that one. This one. Uh, I, I already talked to you. <laughs> I did rest in your inn. Alright, and there's a vending machine around here. Is it this? No, it's... Like, why couldn't... That looks like it. This should be it, right? It's not letting me use... Uh... Huh. Are we sure this isn't it? Uh, what do you have to say? Don't stay. Um... I don't want to stay at it, I want to see what's going on. Vending machine! Uh, this really looks like it. Are we sure that's not it? And I'm just like not pressing it right or something? No. Uh, okay. Hmm. So, maybe we'll... <laughs> maybe I'll try to find something else, uh, and then we'll come back to that because uh, I didn't explore that much up here um, I guess I'm just like because I assume there's some something in the town that'll make this is like the boxing gym right <laughs> I assume there's something in the town that'll make us uh, be able to like do this <laughs> and it seems like it's gonna be pretty funny so I want to know what that is uh, let's see oh this is the inn well it says inn is this the inn oh yeah this would be the inn right and the vending machine is... Is it the... No, that's the bathroom. Um... I was thinking, like... I-N-N, but maybe it's, like, this is, like, the in shop? No, I don't want to listen... I already heard that, like, a lot of times. You want to do it at the counter? Um... Well, I can't order at the counter. There's nobody at the counter. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I think it was worth it coming here just for that. Uh, alright, what am I looking for? I really don't know. Uh, maybe this isn't it, I don't know. Is this it, back here? No? Alright, um, what else have we got around in this area? That was the weapon shop, so I don't think that's it. And then this is the palace. So, oh, oh, wait, maybe he means, like, the honeybee in, because that, there's, why are, all right, why are there, okay, I'll break this down for you, there's a 
a thing that says in here. There's a place where you can sleep that's an inn. And there's a place called Honeybee Inn. <laughs> and since I've checked two out of those three, I'm assuming the last one has got to be it. And I actually got like a, a little hint uh, from a friend that I should come here because there's like some funny like side quest stuff that I can do. Maybe I'm already doing that, I'm not sure. Um, do I need to talk to you? Oh, but he said that the vending machine was inside, so can I not get inside? Um, what about you? Ah, oh, we already did all this. Where do I find it? Where do I go? Uh, and then we talked to him too, right? Uh, we didn't say that option, but I guess it didn't matter. Um, alright, maybe I'll go back and talk to the guy real quick. Maybe he'll say something that is more, like, clear, <laughs> less misleading, um, and that guy was in this shop with like the blue sign up here, right? Yeah. Alright, what did you want again? Dude, how was it? Not yet. I'm counting on you. Um, <laughs> I really have no idea how to do this. Uh, well this sign says in too. <laughs> No, we don't want to do this. Nothing. Maybe. Alright, we'll get today's special then, maybe. I don't want to pay 70 kill. <laughs> well, I guess we'll just enjoy a fine snack here. A snack attack. And then, maybe if... Like, because I can't figure out where to get this. Uh, <laughs> we'll say this option. I fed better dog food. Oh, and then we just leave. Uh, cause I really can't figure this out. So, maybe I'll, like, off-screen until I do. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, I guess I'm gonna do that. Uh, see you in a second, guys. Okay. So, <laughs> I found it. It's this shop. And I guess I didn't go in here before. But this is the one, right? It has clothes in it, so this has gotta be it. And I know I went in here before. I did it when we were exploring. I guess I just forgot. So I haven't talked to anybody in here yet, but... I've literally talked to everybody else in this town, and I can't seem to figure it out. I'm thinking this has to be it. Uh, yes! Okay. Excuse me, I like to get a dress. It might take a little while, a little time. Will that be alright? What's the problem? Well, my father, the owner, has been in a slump lately. You see, he makes all the dresses. And where's your father? He's probably plastered at the bar. So, you're saying we can't get a dress unless we do something about your father? Yes, I'm sorry. He's caused you so much trouble. <laughs> oh, okay. You'd help me bring him back? Well, if we don't do something, we don't get a dress, right? Really? <laughs> Please help my crazy old dad. I don't know what to do anymore. Alright, we'll help your dad. This still does not solve my getting the thing for the guy. But maybe that's, like, stuff we can do later. Because, yeah, a friend told me that I can get into the Honeybee Inn. And if that's what the dude in that shop to the right, like the blue sign shop, is talking about, then maybe i it's not possible for me to do that yet. But we have our new objective, and that's to get the dad of the bar. And since I've gone over this entire town and scoured it, I know that the bar is here. Uh, and are you the dad, maybe? Okay, good. Eris, Eris is coming out, so we know this is the dad. Excuse us, are you the father of the girl at the clothing store? That was a girl? It looked like a dude wearing him like a bandana. Or maybe we, I know there was a girl standing there. Maybe we were talking to the girl. I ain't your father. I didn't say that. Make. <laughs> I want to call the episode this. Make me some clothes. I tire of my purple suit. I wish to wear a fancy dress. I don't make men's clothes, and I don't feel like making anything right now. Cloud, you wait over there for a second. I'll try and talk to him. Yeah, we'll play a little good cop, bad cop. All right, I'll, I'll get a drink. Yo, I said that just once <laughs> he likes to dress up like a girl. So that's why I wanted a cute dress for him. A tough looking guy like that. So how about it? Will you make him one? He looks tough, but inside he uh, just wants to be one of the ladies. Might be interesting. I was getting a little bored just making regular clothes. He'll do it for us? Is it going to be that easy? Yeah, alright. <laughs> Something... Alright, what do I pick here? Is clean better than soft? 
I want to say soft is better than clean. I don't know what the ramifications of this choice will be, but we'll go with soft. And shiny. <laughs> I literally have no idea. Got it. I know a friend that has the same taste as him. I'll go talk to him. What? <laughs> Wait till I get an image in my head. Alright, uh, so do we go back to the dress shop now? This is funny, I like this. I really, when I went into this game, I was thinking it was going to be like all serious, but it's got like some like humorous moments. And I, I really like that in uh, Final Fantasy. I think it's something that gives a lot of charm to these older Final Fantasy games, and the newer ones, I think, though I like a lot of those, I think a lot of them are very defunct of this sort of uh, classic, like, jokey segment charm kind of stuff. I'm not sure. Uh, Alright, so this is the dad, right? I guess that is a girl over there. It looks like... Anybody play Harvest Moon 64? It looks like the character Kai from that. Like the guy who worked in... Ooh, satin dress. Oh, that sounds lovely. It looks like the guy who worked in, uh... Like the vineyard. I think his name was Kai. I don't know. That's who, uh, what I interpreted it as, but... And is that... Was that the dressing room over there? <laughs> Alright. Big reveal. Alright, well, I guess my drum roll is a little preemptive. How do you put this on? Is this really happening? Like, seriously? What are you doing? It's still not right. A wig, that's what you need. Do we have wigs? Thought you might, so I talked to my friend about getting one. You know, the gym, you'll find a lot of people there like you. Go <laughs> and talk to them. Alright, I guess we don't get to see Cloud's uh, pretty, pretty little waist and figure yet. Like you, Eris, what did you tell him? <laughs> Yeah, I guess there are probably some guys in the gym who might uh, feel they have to overcompensate a little bit for something. I don't see why that is. I think everybody, each person has their own unique flower, and we should be tolerant of them. But let's talk to some people in the gym. Right. <laughs> I keep getting lucky with these <laughs> You the one who wants to be cute? Cute. Right. And about the wig. Yeah, I heard, but it'll cost you. Er, big bro, the only way you're gonna get cuter is if you can be big bro. That's right. <laughs> Alright, three on three wrestling match. Cloud versus the dudes. You gotta compete with us. You're right, let's do squats. Alright, we'll beat you out of this gym. Are you the beautiful bro? What? What, you didn't know? Always running around here saying big bro this and big bro that. Never mind that, come over here. I don't understand what is happening. Ready position, X to squat, or square to squat, square squat, X to get up, and circle to go back to the ready position. So it's square, X, circle, okay. Alright, I got it. Is this like another timing thing? Because I really don't like that. Whoever has the most squats after 30 seconds gets the wig, the coveted wig. Okay, so just a, a, a speed thing. Alright, just be quiet. Um... Well, I, I, I want to say that I would like to practice, but I want to also keep going for the sake of the LP, so we're going to say we don't need it. Alright. No, okay. No time to get distracted by the stupid looking timer. Oh, he got up. Mm, he's wasting time. Cloud's got... <laughs> Cloud has got the quad muscles of a champion. Mm, yeah, work them. Work those. Work those thighs, boy. Get those buns of steel. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Three, two, one. Champion. Yeah. Uh. I got it right. You had 17. You had 20. Mm, yes. I am the fittest. <laughs> You're really something. All right, I'm a man of my word. I won a wig in a squat contest. <laughs> Final Fantasy VII, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> All right, we got the blonde wig. Big bro, I'm so mad. I'm so, so, so mad. <laughs> What is going on? Don't cry just because you lost. Bro's fists of steel cut to the bone. See, now that this looks more like a woman to me. I guess it, <laughs> they're just gonna save muscle man Randy Savage. Afro man Randy Savage. I don't know. <laughs> well, we got the wig. Alright, so let's go back to the dress shop. What an episode, folks. Uh, do we talk to the dude? You're all set. Try it on and see how it fits. Alright. I totally have to end the episode right after we see Cloud in the dress. Big reveal! Ta-da! Oh, he looks kinda good. 
<laughs> he just looks more, he looks the same, man. I was expecting like evening wear, like a red dress and like lipstick. This may be a new business for me. <laughs> well, good. Cloud is now in a dress, mission accomplished. Accomplished. Right, should we try it? Thanks for showing us something new. My father's got his motivation back now, so the dress is on the house. <laughs> Miss Cloud. What do you mean, nicely? All right. G good stuff. Oh, you're so cute, Miss Cloud. Oh, I want one. Do you have one that'll look good on me, too? How's this? How about that one? Father, what are you talking about? This one's much better. No, what are you saying? This one. Those all just look like different shades of, like, lime green. Like, blandly. I'm going to change. Eris is changing, too. <laughs> look at Clay. He's got, like, pigtails. <laughs> uh, no peeking. All right, guys. Three, two, one. Peek! <laughs> Not doing a drum. Oh, sh oh, see, she looks good. Aw. Oh, look. You look great. You're no fun. I don't know. I guess it is hard to compete with a cloud here. Oh, look at how he stands. <laughs> oh, good fun on this episode here today on uh, Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. Um, I'm trying to remember how much time I had in the last video. I know it was... Pro it's probably been close to 15 minutes. Maybe we'll see if we can go to the Honey Bee Inn now. Because I'm thinking this is definitely the place... Oh, okay. Hey, princess. Everyone's flocking to me. I know, I'm quite beautiful, yes. I, don't, I only talk to the pretty ones. You're the one. You're just great. Ravishing. Simply ravishing. I like those little bees. They're cute, too. Dude, can I get around you guys? A spiky hairstyle. I only talk to the pretty ones. Uh, what about you? Oh, I'm just... If only you guys knew. Ew. 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 What? <laughs> uh, I don't know what he's talking about. How do I get past this gaggle? Am I not able to? Is that what happens? So I can't go to the inn as Dress Cloud. Alright, so how do I get in here then? I don't know. Maybe I'll have to figure out later. But until na uh, until then, I think we're going to end the episode. So, I've been Snack Attack 8. In the next episode, we're going to hit up the Don and see how he likes uh, our new look. <laughs> and just watch the ridiculous that unfolds, that I'm certain will unfold with that situation. So until then, guys, I've been Snack Attack 8. See you next time. Later. <laughs> Oh, I can't handle this. Oh.